friends tomorrow we observe the armed forces flag day in that connection i have great pleasure in offering my good wishes to the people of our country our country is not merely a piece of land but a real living mother for all of us we are all children of our country it is therefore our duty to save the country the army people standing guard at the distance areas are responsible for the safety of the nation the day is a day to remember the sincere services carried out by the armed forces in protecting our freedom from outside danger and also in keeping the integrity of the nation we have friendly relations with all our neighbors but at the same time we have made it clear that we cannot tolerate any threat on our borders our armed forces are doing a good work in saving our borders it is our responsibility to give our full support to the army men and officers when they rest from service several plans have been introduced which require considerable financial support for the purpose every year we observe armed forces flag day and the public express their thanks for their services by making substantial offering to the flag day account for the welfare of the armed forces each one of us should know that it is our responsibility to give to the account freely so that several measures that are planned out of this amount are fully made available to them your ready help will make you to feel that you have also done something for their cause i would therefore like to suggest to you all on this important day to give freely to the armed forces flag day account this amount will be spent for this said cause only friends i consider it a great privilege to be able to come and meet you on an important happening of your school day the boys and girls who are passing through the course of learning here are the leaders of tomorrow and they will have to take the responsibilities that are given to every young person this is a very important time in your lives this gives you the necessary training and knowledge to develop your personality so that you are in a position to undertake the responsibilities of building up the country the knowledge handed down in the classes of this school will help you become distinguished persons of the country those who receive 
special education have a higher responsibility to perform in the present time. We have worked hard to get independence. We have now to face the real difficulty of our own development. I am sure the same spirit will continue and you will be more and more successful in life. Dear sirs, we acknowledge the receipt of your letter of second instant. We have noted the good business done by you during the last six months. As a token of goodwill, our directors have decided to increase the commission to 20%, which we are sure you will be glad to know. As you know, our interest is always to place new items in the market. Recently, we have developed a small wet grinder. We could offer this at rupees 900 to suit the pockets of low class families. We also give extra discount to our dealers on this product. We propose to appoint you as our stockist. Please let us have your views. Thanking you, yours faithfully.